What is up everybody? Welcome back to the Sneaker Circle. Thank you for tuning in. Thank you for checking me out. If you're new to the channel, please feel free to sub, feel free to comment. In today's video, we are gonna take a look at the Para Vans. I did manage to get one of the exclusive colorways that is only gonna release at the Pada location. And I'm just gonna tell you about a little bit about Pada and like why they're so goaded as a brand. So again, thank you for tuning in. If you're watching this on the release day, happy Friday. Hope you have a great weekend. If you're watching this afterward, then I just hope you're having a great day. You know, gotta, gotta, gotta spread some of that love out because you guys have been showing me so much love lately. So in today's video, we do have the navy and black colorway for the Pada Old School Lows. I love these. The Mean Eyed Cat Vans that they've been doing since 2015 goaded now this release is one of the bigger releases that they've done they've come out with a couple old schools and a couple skate highs not saying they haven't done that before but this is the most like the amount like the amount of colorways they released this time was like crazy and these came out of nowhere for me like i just i saw a tweet they said they were tr they were releasing on the pata website this was an exclusive to just pata itself i was really rocking with it more than i was the other colorways i almost went for a skate high but like yo this and e and in euros this coming from the netherlands this was a pricey like pair of vans so and the cost for me was 144 dollars if i'm not mistaken I'd, I'd have to check paypal one more time but it, it's it's kind of crazy for a pair of old schools when you guys would normally pay like 40 dollars or 50 dollars for a pair of old school from the store but me i've just i've just always like ever since that first pair released in 2015 this is a shoe that's been on my hit list and I'm kind of glad I didn't pull the trigger at $200 for a used pair of like the 2015s. Like this goes to show waiting out. It's it's 100% worth it. It's 100% worth it. And let me get straight into this shoe. So you do have Team Pata all around the box. Why did it just like fly out of my hand? Here we go. Quick shoe label shot right there. Now I'm going to try to make this a quick release because like the, the the Donda Yeezy live stream is going on right now and I really want to go listen to it and like transcend into a different plane. Um, that's definitely my plans after this or while I'm editing. I'll let you know. But yo, yo, having these in his hand is like, it's so hype for me. Like this is, this is a pair of shoes I really wanted. Now the construction on these does feel a little bit better than your regular old school. I really do like how the, um, the rubber sole right here has a little bit extra support. Because to me, when you're beating up a pair of old schools or you're skating a pair of old schools, this is probably one of the places that starts to like separate or go the first. Here's a little quick look at how it kind of like stacks right here. I really like that on the waffle sole. You do have your average suede. Like, don't get me wrong, it's it's pretty nice compared to like van suede. It's not as rough, has a nice sheen to it. You'd have that same suede going through the eyelet, but then you get this like leather streak, this leather like stripe that Vans does in all its old schools. And you get that same leather on the inside right here. It's like a nice soft plush, like grip to your foot leather. Like it, it's it's a nice little detail. It has suede back here as well. Let me get as close as possible just to show you guys. And like this might not be a release for everyone. I know they're not going for too much on like on the on the apps, but it's it's like it's it's wild. You know, it's it's just, it's just wild to me. I, this is definitely just one of the vans that's like on my hit list. I, I'm gonna keep repeating myself. So the biggest signature detail is the Pada on both sides, the Mean Eyed Cat right there. And I really like this. It has kind of like a rubber vulcanized patch right here for off the wall. So not your regular just stamp that like rubs away after time. It's it's like there to stay. The canvas on this is actually pretty like light. It's not the normal canvas you see on these old schools. I really love it. I, I love this release. One of the things they bless you with is this ultra cush insole. I know it's not on all the old schools these days, but usually I, I would always see these on Supreme Vans. And I'm telling you, it's a game changer in terms of comfort. Like if they had this tech for old schools back when I used to skate, my shins would be in such a better state right now. The last detail we're gonna take a look at is right here, Team Pata on the laces. Now you do have a black pair with that same Team Pata on it. You can kind of tell it right there. This has been a consistent theme on all of them. And I mean, it's not my favorite detail. I really don't like text on laces for the most part, but I'm gonna give these a quick pass. These are gonna get beaten into the fucking ground, bro. I'm gonna enjoy wearing these. I'm gonna eat ramen in them. I'm gonna do whatever I wanna do. If I wanna go hiking, I'm not gonna go hiking these. I'm, I'm, I live in Florida, where, where am I gonna hike? Am I gonna like fight alligators? Like, what is this? Who, who, do, who do I think I am? So a little quick detail about Pata. I'm telling you, if you haven't heard of them before, you are slacking, you are sleeping, good night. 
Don't get it confused with Para. That's more of an artist brand. It's, I, I think it's almost in the same region as well. Para is known for some legendary collabs lately. And we do have those SBs coming in a couple days. That I'm, I'm, I'm praying. I'm praying to the to sneakers that like I hit. You know, that's you know, I'm, I'm going to get those for resale if I absolutely have to. Those have to be my collection. But getting back on the topic of Para, yo, there has been leaks of an Air Max. I'll post a picture like right here. Those are beautiful. Those are beautiful. Hopefully we see them next year for Air Max month. But man, man, I'm 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 just I'm just yo, I'm just so excited to go watch this on the live stream that I just don't know what to say. Getting back, Pada, legendary brand. The Air Maxes it's released in the past um, de a decade ago. One of the best Air Maxes you could possibly get your hands on or, or have ever released in terms of like collabs. I'm telling you, they're like Pada doesn't miss. Pada does not miss. And these vans are definitely not a miss. If you can get your hands on these or any of the like non Pada exclusive colorways, any of these right here, I'm going to just go for it. They're the perfect beater shoe. They're different. People are going to ask what the hell does mean I'd cat. Just, just, I'm telling you, just, just go for them. This has been Danny. Thank you for tuning in. I love you guys. Thank you for a thousand subs. I have so many videos I want to release for you guys, but all the shoes are delayed. Ooh, I'm mad. I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace.